Hey guys, so the VEDA that I filmed this morning walking home from work um, is going to take forever to upload because I kind of rambled for like 10 minutes. I didn't have time to edit or sit around and wait for it to upload um, because I'm going back to work. Um, but I figured I would film just maybe a short little something to give you for VEDA today because I don't know, it's just beautiful outside and you know vlogging on the way to work. I'm at least a little more awake and with it. Uh, yeah. I watched the royal wedding and that was kind of fun. I won't lie. I'm kind of looking forward to maybe looking up some pictures if I get any free time at work because some of those outfits and some of those hats were hilarious. And yeah. I think it's crazy how you can go from like disaster weather to just gorgeous and amazing and know that our God is in charge of and in control of both of them and that's what that's what to me is what like makes God feel so much more powerful when you think about something as simple and calm as this beautiful weather or something as like strong and mighty and powerful and dangerous as a mile wide tornado or you know a huge tsunami or something like that it just it's so humbling because we have no power no control there's nothing that we can do against a mile wide of wind like it just makes you realize how frail how weak, how minor humanity really is and compared with the forces of the world and of the universe. And then to know that our God can quiet that with one word is just it's like unfathomable to me. So, yeah, and it's like awe-inspiring say like a lot you guys I'm sorry I just noticed it more today but I know I do it all the time dad so yeah when I lived in France there's this thing um you would say oh, c'est terrible. Um, like it's terrible which was slang for like the closest would be maybe like wicked cool um when you were actually saying like that thing was really awesome and I think it's interesting how words like terrible or something can be used for the opposite for good because something that is terrible is also awesome at the same time so I like to use awesome a lot when I'm thinking of something being awe-inspiring because that to me should be the root of what awesome really is because it has the word awe in it but anyway uh, that's probably long enough for my little brief fill-in vlog so there you go bye <laughs>